The Minneapolis St. Paul International Airport was 82 degrees on the 3 p.m. and 4 p.m. observation. This is the highest dew point temperature reported on an hourly observation at the Minneapolis St. Paul International Airport since hourly dew point records began in 1945. The previous hourly dew point record was 81 degrees, which was set on July 30, 1999. A dew point of 81 degrees was also reported at the airport on Sunday, Monday, and earlier today, or July 1st 7, 1st 9 slash. The Minnesota State Climatology Office is the official source of dew point records across the state. This new record will be considered unofficial until it is confirmed by the staff at the State Climate Office. Now here is the hazardous weather outlook for portions of central and southern Minnesota and west central Wisconsin. For this afternoon and tonight there is a slight risk of severe storms for central and east central Minnesota and west central Wisconsin, mainly along and north of the Interstate 94 corridor, late this afternoon into the evening. There is some uncertainty in this potential, and it is possible that the greater threat may be in northern Minnesota. If storms do form, they will likely be severe with the possibility of an isolated tornado. Once again, afternoon heat indices will get into the 105 to 115 range, with lows overnight only falling into the mid-70s to lower 80s. See the latest excessive heat warning statement for more information. And now the extended outlook for the period Wednesday through Monday. Thunderstorms are possible Wednesday night ahead of a cold front that will work across the outlook area. Large hail, damaging wind gusts, and locally heavy rainfall would be possible with any storms which develop. Chances increase again for thunderstorms across the entire area Friday into Saturday night as another surface boundary slowly moves through. Hot and humid conditions will continue across the outlook area through Wednesday, with high temperatures mainly in the 90s, and heat index values above 105 degrees. See the latest Texas if heat warning statement for more information. Spotter information statement, sky warned spotter activation may be needed late this afternoon and evening over central Minnesota and parts of west central Wisconsin. Excessive heat and humidity continuing through Wednesday, due to a prolonged period of the heat and humidity, an excessive heat warning remains in effect for central and southern Minnesota, including the Twin Cities and all of west central Wisconsin, through 9 p.m. on Wednesday. Afternoon heat indices will exceed 105 degrees for several hours both today and Wednesday afternoon, with overnight low temperatures only falling into the middle 70s to lower 80s. The combination of hot temperatures and high humidity will combine to create a dangerous situation in which heat illnesses are likely. Drink plenty of fluids, stay in an air-conditioned room, stay out of the sun, and check up on relatives, neighbors, and pets. Now for the National Weather Service forecast for the Twin Cities metropolitan area. Tonight, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms in the evening, then mostly clear overnight. Lows around 75. South winds 5 to 15 miles an hour. Highest heat index readings around 110 in the evening. Wednesday, mostly sunny. Highs around 95. Southwest winds 10 to 20 miles an hour. Wednesday night, partly cloudy. A 30% chance of showers and thunderstorms in the evening. Lows around 70. West winds 5 to 15 miles an hour. Thursday, mostly sunny. Highs around 85. West winds 5 to 10 miles an hour. Thursday night, partly cloudy. A 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms overnight. Lows 65 to 70. South winds 5 miles an hour. And now for the extended forecast. Friday and Friday night, partly cloudy with a 40% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs in the mid-80s. Lows around 70. Saturday and Saturday night, partly cloudy with a 50% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs in the mid-80s. Lows around 70. Sunday. Severe thunderstorm watch number 664 remains in effect until 1 a.m. Wednesday and now includes the following county, Boat County, Wisconsin. 
Remember, a severe thunderstorm watch means that conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including large hail and damaging winds, and, and close to the wash area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to an OAA weather radio, commercial radio and television outlets or internet sources for the latest severe weather information.